jump right in with a lovely kitten that goes by the name of Amber Gambler. And she is joined by our veterinarian here on staff, Dr. Alyssa Dayton. So you guys can go ahead and follow me. Hi, oh. everyone. All right, Dr. Dayton, what can you tell us about lovely Amber Gambler here? So Amber Gambler is a four-month-old female. Um, she's been here for about a month now. Unfortunately, before Amber came to us, she had an injury. And we're not sure what happened, but she has nerve damage in the back of her tail. So what that means is that over time, um, her, she's lost the ability to hold her urine. So in Amber's case, she actually holds it all the time, but as an owner, you have to express her bladder three times a day. As you can see though, it doesn't bother her in the slightest. She is still a playful little four month old kitten. Um, she's really good for the bladder expression. You actually just kind of hold on to her and give her a little squeeze and she lets it all out for you. But she does need kind of a special home, but if you've ever wanted a cat and didn't want to have to have the smell of a litter box, she's your girl. Um, she does not hold her little poops, but she can have a little diaper on that'll catch them when they come out, but you don't have to take them out. Thankfully, she does that on her own. But you can see it doesn't stop her in the slightest. Amber's one of our favorites around here now because she's so playful, even though she's been through kind of a hardship already at such a young age. But she is ready to go looking for a special family that's ready to take care of her the way that she needs <laughs> <laughs> but she's super playful she loves toys she's an amazing cat she just has some special needs that she needs a good family that's going to be prepared to take care of her so for the average adopter expressing that bladder mm -hmm. would be relatively easy so easy and our clinic staff would be happy to show you guys how to do it but pretty much all you have to do is we kind of just put her over a sink and we hold her up and you just squeeze her little bladder right here and the rest takes care of itself. Awesome. Another prime example of an animal that had a rough start, like you can see it doesn't affect her personality whatsoever. Thank you very much, Dr. Dayton. Let's no see. Problem.